still come at you. You go out there and get put to sleep. Let's just go ahead and sign your the death certificate of your career. There's no more career after that. Yeah, we're gonna see. I want to see how hard he hits, Mike. I, Mike, I, I really want to see, bro. Let's see all the legends, the myths, because you're Iron Mike Tyson, but I have an iron chin. Oh, uh, shut that. the like, fuck up. I, I take shots, so. You take I think shots. You're, you're going to take shots. Being able to deal with his 58 power, year old that man. Something uh, that it's going to make it interesting. Jake Paul is an absolute promotional genius Kenny. because he knows everyone wants to see him get knocked out, and he picked a guy in Mike Tyson who, yes, at 58, can probably still knock out, I think, most men on the planet. Um, you know, I look at some of those videos, John, that you were talking about, him hitting pads, and I'm like, are they fast-forwarding this thing? How is a 58-year-old man still moving with that kind of speed and ferocity? Well, you're talking about Mike Tyson, who probably won the genetic lottery, so it's, it's absolutely possible. I think it's, you know, he's came a long way from YouTubing. And listen, <laughs> I've seen a YouTube of him at 16 doing weird dances. That's not the guy I'm going to be fighting. This guy's going to come. He's going to try to hurt me, which I'm accustomed to. And he's going to be greatly mistaken. What I can tell her, Mike is a monster. And the only thing I can guarantee, Mike going to touch Jay, 100%. It's going to be impossible <laughs> to Mike don't touch Jay. Let's see how Jay will react after that. He goes out very aggressive overly aggressive like he did against Ryan Boland, swinging punches like an absolute maniac, Mike Tyson might just catch him. Mike Tyson's going to bob and weave like he always does as the shorter guy, get on the inside, look for those openings and look to land some of those big punches. Could you imagine if J. Paul gets knocked out? Oh, my God. So this again, yeah. it's not Jake taking a risk. It's Jake being moronic. 